to the President of the United States, we are anonymous. We the people, are the words in the beginning of the United States Constitution, in respect of the Constitution, we the people, veto your decision to implement the National Defense Authorization Act, we the people demand your resignation effective at the end of this term, we are forced into this position due to your lack of ability to properly represent the people of America, because of your inability to make a rational decision on behalf of the American people, you are found guilty of domestic terrorism along with your co-defendants, Senators John McCain, Joe Lieberman, and Lindsey Graham. The four of you are also guilty of the implementation of fear in the American people. From this election year forward all decisions regarding the American people will take place with the people of America in the process. The National Defense Authorization Act is a direct violation to the United States Constitution. You do not have the right or the authority to implement a bill that contradicts the Constitution of the American people. At the end of this term you are hereby to report to Guantanamo Bay Military Detention Center for a maximum of 15 years. This goes to all perpetrators involved in the violation of imposing on American rights. You are the terrorists. You are the threats on the American people. This is not a request. This is an order. From the American people. By the American people. And for the American people. Because we the people believe in the United States Constitution. It is not an imperfect document. The words instilled in it depict the freedom of American citizens. We the people also order the release of Private First Class Bradley Manning, effective immediately. His actions of exposing the truth are justified and proof that the United States government is corrupt. We the people demand the removal of the corruption within the United States government. And we the people will remove the corruption from the government. PFC Bradley Manning has done nothing but exhibit the truth, courage, and honor to expose the truth and corruption in our military and the people within the government that try to cover it up. PFC Bradley Manning is a noble human being. His actions are justified and his detention is the work of corruption. Mr. President the fear you have instilled on the American people is unjustifiable and will not be tolerated by the President, Senators, Governors, or Mayors. You may have been born on American soil. But the actions of your parents relinquishing your American citizenship to reside in Kenya should have made you exempt from the presidency. So in respect to you, effective at the end of this term you are to hereby resign from the presidency. You are hereby ordered to cease all campaigning for a second term. For clarification this has nothing to do with your Muslim faith. This has to do with your citizenship. We the people demand responsibility for the actions taken upon our government. We are taught from a young age to admit when we are wrong. That same principle applies to the United States government as well. We the people of America, demand a presidential pardon for PFC Bradley Manning. PFC Bradley Manning's military record will be cleared of all charges of his actions. We the people will tolerate no unjust laws. And we the people will be included in the decision-making process of the SOPA bill. The United States government does not have the authority to implement a bill that only benefits the Motion Picture Association of America, resulting in the destruction of the Internet. The implementation of this bill will result in $47 million of taxpayer money. The implementation of this bill will only take place if the people of America vote on it. For far too long the people of America have lived by laws proposed by dictators. No more will the people suffer from dictatorship. To the people of America. You are hereby encouraged to demand your right to be part of the voting process that instills laws in the American lawmaking process. We are anonymous. We are legion. We do not forgive political corruption. We do not forget your relinquished citizenship. Expect us.